A graduation surprise. Dixie Heights High School seniors were prepared to accept their diplomas tonight without the presence of their longtime class president. Earlier this week, we told you a health scare landed Casimir Thornberry in the hospital. But as you're about to see, he wasn't going to let anything stand in the way of his special night. school graduation, a huge milestone for these students who are ready to close one chapter and start anew. Perhaps no one was more ready for this day than class president Casimir Thornberry. It was such a blessing and it was such an honor to be able to have these kids in my life the past, gosh, 18 years. But hours before the ceremony, Thornberry wasn't wearing the old cap and gown. In fact, he was still in a hospital gown. He's been at Cincinnati Children's Hospital since his lungs suddenly collapsed earlier this month. He was prepared to give his speech from his hospital bed, but thanks to a few heroes, as his mother calls them, Thornberry was able to make it to graduation. They literally made a boy's dream come true, and I just am grateful beyond words. For him to be able to come and deliver the speech on his own is a pretty special moment, so we're pretty proud of him. and. We're really happy he's able to join us today. You became being successful. He's been writing this speech for four years, getting to know each of his 340 classmates and hoping to encourage and inspire them to define their own future. I did get nervous towards the end. Um, I was more excited. My legs started to shake a bit, um, but I was so happy. It ended with a standing ovation, an overwhelming feeling for the student who prides himself in being a leader. A leader with a drive for success, a collapsed lung, and a great sense of humor about it all. It was breathtaking. <laughs> um, literally. Good for him. Thornberry is attending UC in the fall. He hopes to attend law school and become a prosecutor someday, focusing on domestic violence. A big congratulations to all of the Dixie Heights students tonight and other high school graduates grabbing those diplomas this weekend. Good for you.